I view science as a form of art in that we constantly push the boundaries of the unknown. I'm Emmanuel Levy and I was born in Morocco and raised in France. I live in the Weizmann Institute with my wife, Melanie, and our three kids. My research is about understanding life. All living organisms, humans, birds, fishes, they are made up of cells, and each cell is like a tiny factory. In my lab, we work on proteins, which are essential building blocks composing these tiny cell factories. When you think of a factory, you probably imagine machines and production lines that are organized according to a specific floor plan. But cells, they are not like that. The proteins, the equivalent of the machines in a factory, they are free to move in all three dimensions of space. We know very well how proteins are created, but we know much less about how they assemble together. The purpose of my research is to reveal basic principles that underlie the self-organization process between those proteins. We characterize how these proteins come together, and we do this in different ways. We use computational analysis, as well as several different kinds of microscopy. Our findings shift the paradigm of how quickly new protein assemblies can emerge during evolution, both in health and in disease. People saw that it was difficult to create new connections between proteins, but what we found it is that it's actually very easy. In fact, the proteins have to work hard not to connect. Our work provides a simple mechanism to engineer new protein nanomaterials, but also it suggests that many more diseases can be caused by such a mechanism of protein high-order self-assembly. The Weizmann campus is a bit like a kibbutz, except that we don't milk cows. We milk ideas. Exploring these ideas is my daily fuel. Debbie has been a tremendous supporter of my career before even day one. Emmanuel has the artistic skills to put his imagination into pictures and the scientific skills to put his imagination to the most rigorous tests. I think it's this combination that makes him so unique as a scientist. I consult with Emmanuel most often when I need to represent something that's complicated in a simple visual way. And he always has some ingenious suggestion to make. Ten years ago, she contacted me to see if I would be interested to join the Weizmann Institute and live in Israel, and here I am. Receiving the Blavatnik Award is an immense honor for me and for the lab, because it gives us this boost of confidence that we are on the right track. Artists, they reveal hidden beauties of the world, be it with a brush, a piano, or a typewriter. We, scientists, follow a similar process, except that we use ever more sophisticated instruments. This idea that we can explore and reveal the inner workings of the world around us is to me very inspiring.